Yo guys, welcome back to a brand new PDCGO video and forget ADP Zashian. Forget that deck, put it out of your brain. Instead, focus on ADP Copper Aja. Okay, that was a meme by the way. I'm not actually serious about this deck being that OP, but this deck is going to be really cool. This is another build of ADP Metal, but this time we're not going to be playing Zashian as our main attacker. We're going to be playing Copper Aja. Now, Copper Aja, I thought about how to build this card with Metal Saucers and maybe Magnezone. Didn't really like it too much. I actually think this card works better, honestly, with ADP. Um, one of the reasons why I like it is because Copper Aja's damage output is a little weak. 220 damage is good, obviously, but it's sometimes not good enough. So having the ADP's extra 30 damage to do 250 sometimes puts you above and allows you to take one shots. And it's a non-GX 190 HP Pokemon. So this thing is already pretty bulky. So before we get in the video, of course, shout out to the sponsor, Car Cam and TCG, guys. As always, if you're still looking for PDCGO pack codes, if you're still trying to get Sword and Shield codes now while well, they're still hot, get them at Car Cavern. You can get them singly, get them in lots of 50. They also have a really good deal going on where you can get uh, Sword and Shield codes and uh, stuff like that in lots of 100. If you guys still obviously want other codes like Evolution Kit codes, uh, Trainer Kit codes, um, any other pack codes like Unbroken Bonds or train or team up or anything like that get them over at car cavern if you get anything from car cavern guys again make sure you use my discount code code ldf for the checkout get yourself a five percent discount on your purchase to support the channel help yourself out and up at car cavern so shout out to our sponsor car cavern use code ldf so let's take a look at our list here so yes this is adp copper Aja. um the whole concept of this deck is you're gonna obviously do alter creation and then hopefully use ultimate ray ultimate ray building up a copper Aja, and then that's this one of the best ways to build it up in my opinion is through uh, alter creation or uh, ultimate race sorry like the build like with metal saucers is fine but three metals you need three metals that's a lot of metal energies that you need to use to build up this guy and uh, really the best way to get that going is to either metal saucer or of course through altered creation to build this guy up now as you can see this card is a 190 hp stage one pokemon so it's pretty good actually it's got a lot of hp for a stage one and it only gives a one prize card which is really relevant um so some other stuff in the deck uh, to kind of support us. I am, of course, playing Zacian. It's a metal deck. We kind of have to play Zacian. There's no reason not to play this card. Uh, but we're not playing any more than just one because this is not ADP Zacian. I'm actually playing a Galarian Berserker. This is here to allow us to uh, let Copper Aja do 270 damage. I'd actually try to recommend maybe try to figure out a way to get more of these in the deck because this guy doesn't do 250 with the ADP's alteration, which is good. But uh, sometimes you need a Berserker to go above and beyond. But we do have a Ditto to support that. I'm playing an Absol. Just because Absol is really good. Uh, there's no Fiona in this deck. Uh, this deck, I guess, doesn't really have the most insane win condition against Mill. Um, but it, it's just more of a beat stick deck. I got four Jirachis, uh, one Dedene. Pretty simple stuff. Uh, we go into the items now. We got four Custom Catchers. Uh, we got four Metal Saucers. Two Pokecom, four Quick Balls. Pretty simple stuff. Um, the Customs are really good. I got three Switch. Uh, three Tag Calls because we need to find ADP. I'm only playing one Swell, uh, because we're, we have to fit in like a stage 1 line and stuff, it's actually kind of, it was a little clunky to find more room for a lot of other stuff, so I'm only playing the one Swell. Um, I got two Cynthia, one K Cynthia, two Goose Mahala to get us Aura Energy, a Skateboard, Metal Frying Pan, two Malolanas, there's actually a good reason why we need to play Malolana, is because, as you can see, Copper Edge's Attack Muscular Noise only does damage, only works if this thing doesn't have 8 or more damage. So this Pokemon has 80 damage on it, this thing does not work. But with Maulana, we can heal that 80 damage. We also play a Frying Pan. As you can see, we are not playing Buff Padding, which would make sense because we would then, you know, have like 204 HP. Um, but Frying Pan is actually better because one, the Frying Pan takes rid of your weakness, but it also means that it's harder for this guy to get 8 damage on it. That's why we have the Frying Pan in the deck and not the Buff Padding. I am just playing 3 Research, 2 Ore Energies, 8 Metal, and 2 Waters to round out the ADP Copper Roger deck. It's a really cool archetype. Um, forget what you know about ADP Station. Play ADP Copper Roger 2020. You won't regret it. Okay, guys, here we go. Let's go do some games now with our Copper Aja. Cop Copper Aja? Is that how it's pronounced? Copper Aja? Copper Aja? ADP deck. See what we're up against here first. Looks like a Malamar Ultra Necrozma deck, or it also could be Mew 3 Malamar. We'll see. Uh, we don't go first. That's actually pretty bad. Hopefully, they let me go first, but they're probably going to go first because they are playing Malamar, which is a stage 1 deck. Um, okay, we got an ADP start. That's fine. We have a Quick Ball. We have a Cynthia. We can make this hand work, I guess. Now uh, we'll see what uh, we'll see what my opponent's gonna be playing. Ooh, they let me go first. Really? Okay. I'll. I ain't complaining. Uh, we'll get rid of the metal saucer. I think we have four. We'll uh, get a cuffant. 
because we want to attack with Copper Agile here. And we'll just go for Intrepid Sword. And I don't know if I'm going to attach an energy, though, to be honest. Yeah, we don't want to. Okay, but we do get a Drachi and a Switch, which is also pretty good. I mean, the, the main star of the show has to be Copper Agile. We can't just be like, all right, Alter Creation, build up Zacian. We got to build up my boy, uh, Cuffin. Really surprised Let Me Go first, though. I, If they're playing... Malamar, that actually doesn't really make much sense because I guess like if they're playing the Lily engine still I guess but like the Lily engine is pretty unreliable Like why would you use Lily because like Lily if you think about it I, I even talked about this in one of my blog posts on card cavern I said why would you ever use Lily over research now because like you get to use Lily Okay, you get the turn one eight cards that is technically better than doing a research But with Lily in the late game, you're maybe doing Lily for like two or three cards Why would you ever want to do that? Ooh, they're playing Trevnor. That's actually pretty scary. Might have to, uh, deal with this ASAP. Okay, we drew a Copper Edge off the top deck. Well, Cynthia here, hopefully we draw a Water Energy. We do not get one. Okay. That is fine. No, it's not. <laughs> we'll have to go to Dene. Could bench the other ADP. Maybe I should have. It's fine, though. There we go. As long as we get the Alter Creation off, we're good. Now, the problem here is they're probably going to Pale Moon me, which is going to set me back quite a bit. Uh, but we could still build this guy up for Muscular Nose doing 250 damage. We'll see what happens here. We What we'll, what we'll probably do is we'll Caitlyn Cynthia probably get back the Research and then um, Metal Saucer to this. We could also build up Zacian, but we don't have the extra damage modifier. This thing is 270 HP. Like, I, I gotta accept we're never gonna one-shot Trevon and Dustmar. All right, let's see if they have a switching card. Hopefully they don't. I would like to pull off an ultimate ray here. Okay, Lily for three. Do not find a switch, please and thank you. So I can so I can use ultimate ray. That would that would make my day if you do not if you do not do that. Please spare me. No, you suck. Oh, but they go into Ditto. Okay, that's actually perfect. That is perfect. There's a tag call. That's actually pretty good. Um. All right, well, Caitlyn, Cynthia, wait, the Pokecom. I don't think we really need that right now. We'll get back. I think we'll take Cynthia, because we don't really want the research, because we have the two saucers. I guess it doesn't matter. Okay, there's a Chaotic Spell. That's really good. And uh, we'll just go Ultimate Ray, knock out the Ditto, take our two prizes. And we will indeed just put three Metal Energies onto our Copper Aja. Like, I don't think they're playing Customs. They could be playing Pokemon Catcher, and then they can catch her at the Copper Edge. But again, we have all these saucers. Okay. Oh, there's Absol. So I'm really glad we, um, they could stand me here. But I'm actually really glad we didn't play, get the research because we don't really need it because we already have the three saucers in our hand. And if I research, we're going to lose all those saucers. And there's a reset stamp. I was praying that they wouldn't have a reset stamp, but there it is. Okay, we do have a custom and a tag call, though. So it's all good. Actually... That might not be that good, actually. We'll see if they go for Night Watch or Pale Moon. It's honestly probably best for them not to do Night Watch because Pale Moon can knock me out easier. But then we just tag call for a Switch. Malamana, sorry. So let's see what they do here. Let's see what they do. Okay, so they are going to Night Watch me. Hopefully we keep the custom and the tag call. Okay, we lose the tag call, but we keep our custom, which is fine because we've already played a custom. Bruh. Okay, then. What? Go There goes that. <laughs> um, actually, we would be able to win if we had the other customs in the deck, because then we could just go custom catcher. Yeah, it's not going to work out. I mean, we can just bring in the Tina. But how are we ever going to deal with this? Honestly, maybe we just hit him with an ultimate ray. I'm actually down just to ultimate ram and then just build up the Zacian. And then we can use Zacian as like game closer bait. I actually like that. Um, might want to put an energy onto Dene just in case it gets brought into the active spot. That yeah, doesn't really matter. But then this way, like, okay, they'll Night Watch me. We will lose our customs, uh, which is obviously really bad. But then they get knocked out, and then 
they they lose. I want to attack with this guy though, but we can't really use it right now. If they're playing a more Giratina focused build, obviously we would use the Copyright Gen. It looks like that is going to be game. My opponent just kind of commits. And we keep both, we keep one of the catchers, which means we can just custom for three, draw into a supporter probably, and just kind of go ham if we really wanted to. But we're just going to win the game. We're obviously going to just knock him out with Copyright because this is a Copyright video. And Muscular Noise for 250, taking out my opponent here. Um, and yeah, that's going to be that. Pretty simple concept with this deck, Copper Raja with, with ADP. Nothing too fancy, nothing too special. And the nice thing is, with only playing one Zacian, we don't have to rely on a more ADP Zacian deck. And oh, we prized, oh, we prized a custom. We also prized two of our water outs. That's actually lucky that we got that water energy that turn that we did get it. I don't know why they never did Pale Moon either. That really would have helped them too, I think. But uh, I ain't complaining. And that is going to be a dub with the ADP Copper Aja deck. <laughs> okay, here we go, guys. Getting into another game with Copper Aja, Copper Aja, ADP. I, I, it's got to be another way to pronounce it, bro. It's got to be. Uh, we'll see what we're up against next. Uh, ooh, Rillaboom Egg Route. That'll be interesting. So if we go first, that's good for us. But it's also bad because they get to do turn one super growth kind of a pick your poison type of scenario but we do get a pretty good start we do get a pretty good start here not gonna lie though this egg route matchup might be a little sketch because of tropical hour okay so let's play the metal first let's do stellar wish first see what this gives us okay we'll take a cynthia I was thinking about taking Quick Ball too. Okay, we'll do this. We'll get the Zacian. Hey, our Zacian's prize. That's a big yikes. Um, I guess we'll take Cuffin then. Yeah, prizing Zacian, not very good. Um, play the Metal. We'll just pass. I should. I probably should have played the Ore Energy, but I didn't know what I wanted to get rid of there exactly. We should have played the Escape Board though. Okay, well, the good news is they don't have a Grookey in play. That's that's a good sign. Okay, they actually play Salasaur. So, actually, it's kind of good that I'm holding this because of Pollen Hazard. All right, let's see if they get a Grookey here. Hopefully, they don't get a Grookey because I don't want them to get a Rillaboom in play. The slower it takes them to get a Rillaboom, the better. So, I don't want them to get... Because if they go Rillaboom, they're using a Tropical Army, and I don't want that to happen. They get a Fire Energy with their Energy Spinner. Okay. What type of Pokemon could they be playing? What fire attackers are they playing? That's that's interesting. Okay, they do have a Kaelin Cynthia. They get rid of the fire. Alright, do they find a Grookey here? Hopefully not. I don't want them to get Grookey in play. They are going to Tag Call. I would have assumed they would have grabbed Grookey. I wonder what they're going to get with Tag Call, actually. What do they need? What do they need? Like another Cellsaur and Malolana. Okay, no Grookey. That's really good. That's good. So we will get to be able to do um, Alter Creation here. Hopefully we can draw something that like I don't really care to discard with the Aura Energy. Another Jirachi. That's perfect. Perfect discard bait. Uh, we'll play Cynthia first, obviously. Try to get some other good things here. We do get a Chaotic Swell. We'll put that in play. We also get a Ditto Prism. Which is pretty good. Alright, we'll Stellar Wish. Uh, do we want the research? I think we'll take it. There's actually a good chance we don't even get damage next turn. Actually, we won't get damage. There's something in play. We'll Alter Creation. And it's good we got the Ditto, because we actually will... Well, I guess the Levani's in play. But we will need the Copper Aja. If we can maybe custom Levani next turn, if we can draw into a custom catcher here... Um, we can knock out their Levani, and then we can put Berserker in play, and then Copper Aja one-shots the Celesaur and the Rowlet Executor. We probably need Absol here, too, because they might be playing Buff Padding. We'll see how this goes, So It's really good they haven't gotten a Grookey yet, because they would have super growthed into one by now. I'm actually surprised they don't even play it. Okay, hopefully we can draw a custom here, because I really do want to knock out Lee Vanny. Because all we gotta do is knock out Lee Vanny, and I doubt they're playing any more than just a 1-1 line. So we knock out Lee Vanny, and then all we gotta do is just knock out this guy with a Berserker. 
Okay, we drew a Caitlyn Cynthia. That can help us get to where we need to go. Come on, give me a custom catcher piece. No, didn't get a custom there. Um, that's unfortunate. I think we'll just get Cuffin. If I had a Switch, that'd be really nice, but we don't have it. That's fine, though. We can swim with Ultimate Ray. Um, depending on how much they heal here, we can finish them off with Copper Aja. Actually, no, they get to heal all the damage, just realized, because they can Vile Plume Malolana. That's fine. No, it's not, but it's not the end of the world. Hmm. We'll see what they do here. They're probably gonna Malolana into the Cellsaur. And unfortunately, we'll heal their Egg Row here. Our game plan really has to be knock this Levani out so that we get to use Kaparaja. But Levani has... Your grass Pokemon take 40 less damage. This thing has 160 HP, so we can still knock it out with Ultimate Ray. It actually probably really needs Zacian too. It sucks we prized it. Okay, Pollen Hazard. Hopefully, um, I don't stay burned. We're probably gonna have to research here, unfortunately. Unless we can draw a tag call, we can go Maulana. That'd be best case scenario. No. Okay. I think I have to go to Dene here. Just because I really want to hit, like, a Malolana. So I think we're going to have to go to Dene. We are going to lose quite a few c important cards, especially those three supporters, but... What do we got to do? Alright. Uh, we'll do this. I don't think we need any more ADP, so... ADP... Guzmahala can also go, I think, because we have... I don't even think we can get anything with Guzmahala anymore other than one Aurora Energy. Aurora Energy, whatever you call it. Stellar Wish. Take the Switch. I wanted the Custom Piece, too, but it's fine. So we can go in with Copper Aja here. Uh, he can't knock me out. Oh, he can't do Evergreen either and get uh, the full effect against stuff back. He'll probably do Evergreen, though. It won't knock me out. Evergreen will do 180, but there's no way we can even attack afterwards. So do we just keep doing Ultimate Ray here and build up the other Copper Aja? I think we do. We're going to just force him to keep doing Malolanas. He'll probably have Malolana, though, and he'll probably be able to flee here, but he might not be able to retreat. So, like, if he has to keep doing Pawn Hazard, that's not going to do much for him. Having both the Switch and the Tag Call in my hand is really, really good, allowing us to have a couple outs to finding Switches right now. Alright, they'll probably play Maulana, and they'll probably retreat into Oddish, and then go back into their Cellosaur. But that's their second Maulana that's been played, and I don't think they play any more than two. So let's see what they do here. The only problem is, though, guys, is we are a little low on supporters. Really, we're relying on one Research, and I think we have three Cynthias left. I mean, we don't have a terrible amount. We have 16 cards left, so I guess we don't have the worst amount of odds of supporters, but we'll be okay. I really want to knock out Levani and then just go Preserve. That's literally our game plan. We can knock this out, and then we just got to custom this out, which isn't too hard to do either. Um, if we can eventually knock out a tag team Pokemon. But I do also just want to get these Levani off the board, and then go to Archie. Ooh, they actually bring in... Okay. I wonder what they're doing. They're going to super grow. Hmm... Okay, that's actually pretty good. Do a quick ball. That's good discard bait. We know they have that Malon in their hand. Um, I guess we have to try to dig for a custom play. No. No. I was like, we can... Try to get like a Cynthia there or the other research, dump the hand, try to get double custom to knock this thing out. Unfortunately, we don't have the access to that. So yeah, there's nothing I can really do about that. I think we'll just take the switch. Well, you know, we'll need the Maulana. We'll take the custom. Mm, we don't really need the custom right now. I don't really like the odds. <laughs> no, we'll take the custom because that, that still opens up the door. Because we're probably going to switch next turn, so yeah, that'll still open up the door 
to a knockout on this guy, which will then lead to a Berserker knockout on a Tanky Pokemon. Uh, we have one water in the deck. I guess we thin it. I have no clue where I want to put it. Uh, I guess did any? Because then we can ore energy. Sure, I don't know. It didn't really matter where I put that, but I guess Denny is the best target. I don't know. Okay, they have two plumes. So yeah, are we really need knockout that Lee Manny. And if they play any more than a 1-1 line, we're in trouble. Like if they play 2-2 Lee Manny, I we probably just lose at that point. Because like it's like well, we're not gonna lose. We're gonna be in trouble. And they actually choose to not heal, which makes sense. How much HP do they have? 220. I think we're just shy of a knockout with Copper Aja here, guys. Like, I actually think we're just shy of a knockout. Okay. How much are we doing? They have 220 HP. They have 206. Yeah, so we're literally 10 damage short of a muscular noise knockout. Unless we can get a Berserker in play. Which we have no way to get a Berserker in play. Hmm. Do we have any basics left? I think we do. We have Absol and stuff. We do have Berserker in the deck. Ooh, we prize three of our Cynthias. Wow. So if we get Berserker here, we can knock them out, right? Because we'd be doing 250 plus 270 minus 10. So we will knock them out if we get Berserker here. Alright, we'll see if we find it. We can burn the Custom Catcher too. Because we still have two left. If we really have to, we can use Custom to draw. Okay. This is perfect. Or we can just knock out the Levaney now. Which I think we're going to do. Okay, Ultimate Ray is doing 180, 160. Okay, yeah, so we knock out Levani here. And that, I mean, should be game. We could have knocked out the Egg Route too with Copper Aja, but I think we just want to knock out Levani because it is... We just get that out of the way, and then that's pretty much it. Hopefully we get one of our Cynthia's with the prizes here. That'd be really bad if we don't. Oh. No. That's at least going to get us Berserker to knock that out. I guess we can always retreat into draw chain and then like switch. I don't know. We'll see. Like all we need to do is just go Berserker, Muscular Noise, Knock Mode. And this is why this is the combo of the deck. We'll see if we can pull it off. This is getting not, is it, this isn't even that close of a game right now. My opponent has yet to take a prize. Oh yeah, they're playing Welder. So they're not playing Rillaboom. They're just opting for a more safer route of defense instead of offense with Rillaboom's ability. But all we gotta do, guys, is take him out with the muscular noise. We have two in play, so I mean, really, if we wanted to, we can also just play really aggressive here with our little Comparages. So it's actually really good they don't play Absol, in all honesty. If they had Absol, this would be a lot harder to win. So, if we draw a Pokemon here, we win. If we draw a Berserker, we win. Doing more energy. So, I mean... We have switches left, so like, if Stellar Wish can get us a research, we win. Bruh. Oh, where is my research? That's pretty annoying. I will right, we'll take the custom. I think we're just gonna swing with this Copper Aja. Oh no, we can't, right? Ah, uh, where's our research? This is not good, actually, guys. I should've taken the switch. I should've just switched into this. That was a... That was a bad misplay. We'll have to use custom next turn. I should've grabbed the switch. Yeah, I feel pretty stupid. I feel pretty dumb for not getting a switch there. Okay, we'll do this.
We didn't get the switch to win the game. Oh my god. Okay, that's fine. So we win next turn, pretty much. We win next turn unless they knock out Ditto Prism. It's actually kind of nuts that we didn't get the switch there off the custom. We have the we have the Berserker. We just need the switch. I, I, as long as they just don't get another leap any, we're good. All right, and that is going to be game, guys. We're just going to Solar Beam, knock out my Jirachi. We bring in the Copper Aja, which will body my opponent. One card off, whatever. Okay, let's just get the Berserker in play and hit them with a Muster Noise for 270 damage, knocking out their Celesaur. Bye-bye. If they had a buff pattern on, we actually would have lost because then we... Well, not lost. We wouldn't knock it out because we have Absol in the discard pile. Oh, never mind. We prize more Cynthia's. I guess I don't play four. Why do I, I felt like I had four synthes in the deck, but that will be it for today's piece of video, guys. I think on the Copper Aja ADP deck, you get the whole gist of the deck. Uh, we did get to use Copper Aja quite a bit to finish the game off. That's pretty much what this guy mostly is good at, but it's also just really good in situations where you only want to give up one price card. That's what this big boy can do. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to see another video on Copper Aja, I can maybe try to build around this card with like maybe Magnezone and Metal Saucer. I can attempt to try out a build of that. Um, so if you guys want to see another video on this guy, I can definitely do it. But that'll be a four days video on it, the Copper Aja ADP deck. Uh, pretty cool deck. Um, is it better than Zacian ADP? Obviously not. Uh, ooh, we can buy a pack. Eh, we'll buy a pack, why not? Um, we'll buy a pack. Uh, but yeah, Copper Aja ADP, pretty lit deck. Give it a try yourself. Uh, maybe you will uh, dominate with the deck. Who knows? Maybe the deck is secretly low-key busted. I don't know. But it's pretty cool. Pretty cool stuff. All right, let's just get this pack opened. And what do we get in here? We got a Cinderace. I'll take it. We can trade off a Hollow for something good. But yeah, thanks for watching the video, guys. If you enjoyed, leave a like on the video. Don't forget to subscribe down below to help me on the road to reaching 7,000 subscribers. And as always, guys, make sure to check out our sponsor, Cardcam and TCG, down below, too. If you pick any, pick up any codes there, use code LDF for the checkout. Get a 5% discount on your purchase. Uh, yeah, that'll be it for today's video on the ADP Zation deck. Or the ADP, the ADP Cop Raja deck, not the ADP Zation deck. Forget about ADP Zation. We're playing ADP Cop Raja. Um, I guess we should maybe just play three Cynthia's. I might just cut a Guzma Hala and just go three Cynthia. Maybe that'll be a better build. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. See you guys on the video. Follow me on Twitter down below, too. And that'll be it for the video.